in this lecture, we will learn how to identify what distribution a given data belongs to. Let's go back to our process lead time data case and let's find out whether this data belongs to a viable distribution or not. In order for us to do this, we will need Minitab. So we have this data uh, in column C1 where we have the process uh, time or process lead time which I had shown you earlier as well. So I'm going to go to stat, I'm going to go to quality tools and the fourth item is individual distribution identification. So I'm going to click on that. Now what will this do to us is if we give the data set to this algorithm, it would help us to find out which distribution is our data belonging to. So that's a very, very useful tool that uh, Minitab has. So I'm going to click on this uh, column C1. I'm going to leave the subgroup size as one. So what does that mean? A subgroup of one means that this entire data does not have any subgrouping and each value here is treated as a separate subgroup. 